Hello out there, everyone. I am DJ Particle. This is Particle Play Live. How's everyone doing out there today? Um, after taking it easy yesterday, we're going to kind of uh, take it a little easy today as well with a very, with something a little low stress to get us into the weekend. Um, more of Disney Magical World 2. <laughs> um, and I see we do have uh, two follows since our last stream. Um, Knuckles Burridge <laughs> and um, and uh, Showai Kazilla. Thank you for those follows. Welcome to the Particle Acceleration. Don't know if you're watching right now, but but thank you, but thank you for the follows. We're going to continue where we left off. <laughs> now that I actually have a cool outfit. <laughs> a cool science fiction-y outfit. <laughs> All right, that's a little loud. Let me turn it down. There we go. Okay. All right, explore and enjoy the magical world. All right. First, we're going to go to the cafe. And make sure that uh, the cafe continues to be stocked up. Yeah, we are completely sold out. Okay, we're going to... Uh, um, hold on. Do we have any... Uh, oh, we only have two theme points? Come on. Five lively sweats. Make some more sweets. Can make five or more kinds of sweets? Oh, well, we'll see here. All right. Let's see what we have to work with. All right. Let's see what we have to work with here. Uh, let... Um, hmm. You're super hyped you're in the final battle of Metopia. Nice Kyome! Welcome to the stream, by the way. Uh, let's do some Rapunzel themed stuff. Okay. Okay, so so what's our Oh, we still only have two theme points? All right. Can can we can we decorate to Hmm. Yeah, we don't have a lot of stuff. <laughs> we don't have a lot of stuff to decorate with. All right. Okay, we got that all set. You're gonna lurk? Okay, Kiyomi. All right, now the question is, what do we have to do? What a marvelous surprise! Hiya, pal! All right. Hiya, pal! All right, let's, uh, let's pick stuff here, because we got stuff to pick. Um... What would I do? Oh God! Really? Except I, I well, I could just give it to her. But, 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 but I, but I think it I, is. I can just give it to her. <laughs> I have it. Well, that okay. That was that was probably the uh, easiest quest I've Hi. ever done.
All right. Oh, I have. I think I've done this. We can't find it. We have to see around. Thinking. What? Colorful clover. I have that. Uh, I, I, I didn't just find what you were looking for. I had it the entire time. All right. Okay. Oh, whoa. There's, oh, there's stuff to pick here, too? All right. Okay. Now where now where we last left off though. We were heading over to um to Pooh Corner, I believe. Uh still more stuff to pick. Oh, wait a minute. Let me see if I can unlock more stuff over here. Can I unlock more stuff over here? Because I'm at 26. Yes, I actually can. New recipes received. Okay. All right, so what do we have? An ancient hero outfit? More new recipes? Oh, my God. All right, what do we have here? Wreck-It... Wreck-It Ralph? Oh, my God. No, nothing good there, in my opinion. Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> Peter Pan. Aladdin. Oh, there. Oh, that's what ancient hero outfit is. All right. I, I have to admit, I still like the one I'm wearing right now. Three little pigs outfit. No, 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 no. Keep, keeping the science fiction outfit. Gotta be as Starfleet as possible. Even if it's Disney. <laughs> oh, Kiyome's got the final battle against the Darkest Lord. Alright, what do we have in here? Anything that strikes my fancy over here? Sure, Mickey outfit. Marie out. Marie? Marie? Oh, that's right. I also ha I have that purple winter outfit too. Cool. Ship outfit, for sure. Pen. Oh, jeez. Futuristic TV. Oh, come on! Look, look at this. It says futuristic TV. What is wrong with this futuristic TV? It's Four three. I'm sorry. It's not futuristic if it's four three. I mean, come on. I mean, back when this game originally came out, four three was dead. I mean, seriously, four three really? All right, let's unlock some stuff here, and then we'll go to the poo corner. How you doing? All right, unlock some new recipes there. Don't know if I'm... I'm, I'm not really getting into uh, getting stuff for my house, I do have to admit. Oh, 
What's over here? Mickey Caramel Apple? Oh. Why not? There we go. Oh, wait a minute, what's over here? Is this another dungeon? Welcome to you. This is the Shop of Wonder. Oh god, each time someone says nice to you, you collect magical energy I can use. What can I do with it? Well, I can see your fortune! Oh god! The fortune teller. You can exchange nice points at the Shop of Wonder. Good luck charms have all kinds of effects like increasing the amount of items you gather or helping you do better at dancing and mining. You can also exchange your points for mystery items and new recipes. Oh, jeez. Okay. What? Let me see. I mean, I wait. I have one thousand five hundred one nice points. The hell? Uh, l let me do all three then. Can I? Can I do all three? Ah, uh, got a new sticker. All right, let's put that in. Oh, I see. You can only do one at a time. So, let's see. Mystery items. Oh! Oh, my God. This looks like a now this looks like a good idea. All right, let's get all these then. Yeah, I'm gonna get all these. Yeah, it's Mickey themed furniture, but it's but it's more modernized. Oh god. Another sticker. <laughs> Alright. Alright, we got that. Okay. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Alright, now I'm trying to remember where Pooh Corner is. Try and remember where the uh, portal is. I think it's that one back there. Isn't it this one back here? No, I guess not. Oh, wait a minute. Isn't this one here? No? Time left 27 minutes. For, for what? Oh. Oh, there it is. It's down there. Alright, let's head back to Pooh Corner here.
But first, let me pick all. Let me pick what needs picking. Another puzzle piece there. There's the episode board. Okay. All right, an honest day's work. Rabbit wants to show you something, head to his garden and hear what he has to say. Okay. Alright, let's see what Rabbit needs us to do. Hello, DJ. Thank you again for rescuing Pooh. I don't much trust strangers, but I consider you one of the gang here in the Hundred Acre Wood. That's why I thought they'd teach you a little something. How would you like to try your hand at gardening? Now, you can't just sow seeds and expect them to grow. You've got to water them, too, and pull out any weeds you see. Tend to them with love, and they'll grow and grow and grow. Here, here, why don't you sow this seed for a start? Okay. Press the A button in the garden to plant seeds. Don't forget to water those plants to help them grow. Water lasts for 60 seconds. Most seeds only need to be watered once. Wait a while and soon they'll be fully grown. Keep your garden tidy by pulling out weeds. Weeds will make... Oh my god! When plants fully grow, will start glowing. Now's the time to harvest it. Okay, so where... is the actual gar... Oh, it's over here. Oh, come on! There. <laughs> Alright, so I guess I can only plant, like... Alright, now where's the water? All right, where's the water? All right, say I have to water them. Where's the water? Do I have wa- do I have water? Alright, it says I have to water them. Oh! Okay, so I already had the watering can. Time until the soil dries out. Okay. Hmm. Well, I don't see any weeds, but that might but, but that might just be because I have but that might just simply be because I have so many uh ready to harvest. Oh god. 
Your seed has grown quite nicely indeed. Yes, this is outstanding for your first attempt. I dare say you have yourself a green thumb, DJ. I'll just lend you my garden. If you manage to get any seeds, plant them here. Do your very best to raise the greatest crops around. Weird. Okay. Alright, so we got all that stuff. Oh god, it's Letta. You did it! Sweet kill me! Hi there, DJ! Working hard in the garden, I see. Good for you! You seem to have a knack for growing fantastic crops! Now that you're into gardening, I have a letter for you from Yensin. Here, I'll read it for you. DJ, should you ever wish to return quickly to Castleton from the forest you're in now, simply use that red balloon. It will carry you back to Castleton. In no time at all. I guess he means this balloon. Um, okay. Yep. Flying will get you there in the blink of an eye, all right. How do you think I deliver everything so efficiently? I would definitely make use of that balloon if I were you. Bye bye now! See you later! I mean, later! Oh, God. I'm sorry, but. <clears throat> I'm sorry, but Letta is just so freaking annoying. What's wrong, Pooh? You've been staring at your tummy for a while now. My tummy is saying something. What's it saying? Say, there's something I'd really like to taste right about now. Let me guess. Honey, right? Something yellow and sweet and sticky. Yeah, it's honey. <laughs> hmm, according to my highly precise calculations, Perhaps mean tree sap, of which elm and birch are the worst offenders. Why, I once had the misfortune of touching the stuff. It was so sticky, I lost several feathers in my attempt to break free. Not that owl. Xander, thank you for the host. How are you doing today? It sounds lovely, but that's not what I mean. What I mean is honey. Where do you suppose I could find some honey? As far as I can tell... Since honeybees are the ones who make honey... You ought to go looking for some honeybees first. I'm sure you're right, Eeyore. But my tummy is insistent. It wants honey right now. And I'm afraid it won't listen to reason. Tisk, what are we going to do with you, Pooh? Will you do us a favor, DJ? Find some tree holes and gather honey from inside them. I'll be very grateful if you do. So will my tummy. Without that honey, my tummy may very well deflate. Oh, God, Pooh Bear. And I'll no longer be a roly-poly Pooh Bear. We can't let that happen! Hurry up and find Pooh that honey, DJ! Before his tummy goes away! Ah, uh, okay. I gotta grab some honey. I assume it's over here. Where am I? Um... Okay, where is the frickin' honey? Where's the honey? Nope, that's rabbit's hole. Oh, got a new sticker! A harvesting rookie. Alright. Oh, 
Oh god, I got a ton of freaking seeds. quickly around here. It grows a lot quicker than it does in Animal Crossing, I'll tell you that. Okay. Now it says the honey's... Oh, there's some... There's some honey. I see the honey now. Alright, how much more honey do I need, though? You know, for a hundred acre wood, there isn't really a lot of uh, woods around here. <laughs> Stone? Oh, no, potato seeds. Okay. Except there's one problem. Oh, wait, 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 there, that, there we go, there we go. Honey, honey, honey. Okay, three holes remaining, one. Where is it, though? Honey, no thank you. Sticky and bouncing don't go together very well. I mean, there's a tree hole over there, but uh, it's a, kind of a big tree hole. Because that's the thing, I only see two trees. Oh, wait, 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 wait. there it is. Hold on. There it is. And we got a raid from Hero Chris. Hey, Hero Chris. How you doing today? Let's see what you were playing today. I think you were playing Metopia, weren't you? Yep, yes you were. What's going on, Chris? Did you by chance bring me some honey? I'm so glad you're here. My tummy was just telling me it couldn't hold out much longer. There's, there's your honey poop. Dear me, is that the sweet smell of honey? Oh, now my tummy is saying something else. Thank you so much, DJ. Now to dig right into my favorite treat of all. Oops, uh, but before I do, I have something important to tell you. Rabbit was looking for you. He says he has something to talk to you about. I forget what. Stream was shenanigantly fun with post-game Metopia. Nice! All right, here you go, Tummy. You'll be just fine now. Okay, so Pooh's gonna have some honey. Uh, hello, DJ. I understand you found that honey and got it to Pooh. I wanted to talk with you about the garden. See, this here garden can grow more than just vegetables. You can also plant flower seeds and raise them too. Vegetables are nice and all, but flowers have a certain charm. They're so beautiful and they smell so nice. Plus, the honeybees go crazy once they're in bloom. If you get your hands on some seeds, go on and plant them. Alright. If you have flowers in your garden, honey will build up faster. Oh my god! I can get I can get honey from the garden too. Okay. Alright. A new hop do you do? Oh but oh but it's a 32. Yeah, I gotta wait until I gotta wait until sticker level 32 to be able to do that, unfortunately. Kiyome with a raid now! Hey! It's Kiyome sub! And I and and of course, uh They were also playing Metopia. They just defeated the Darkest Lord! How you doing, Kiyome? And 
Matt, welcome to the stream. Okay, so so I've uh, got some I got some stuff to harvest, I think. Uh, oh, ready to harvest, okay. Holy carrots. Matt, thank you for the host. How are you doing today? Okay. All right, I'm going to do some fluffy dandelions this time. Oh, I only have the one fluffy dandelion. Okay. All right. What, hon? Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. All right. Oh, jeez. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, what's next? Wait a minute, wait, what's next? If it's trying to point me to the episode board, I don't have anything I can... Oh, is there something else I can do with the episode? No, I can't. I'm not, I'm not sticker level 32 yet. So I can't, so I can't do anything with that yet. I may have to go back to Lilo and Stitch. All right. I may have to go back to Lilo and Stitch land. <laughs> God, there's a there's a ton of stuff to to grab and put in hundred acre wood. All right, I'm gonna have to go back. All right, all right, I'm going to wait for these to finish growing. I'm going to wait for these to finish growing, and then I'm going to head back to the cafe, replenish the cafe. Huh. Come on. Come on, finish up. Finish up. This is start this is getting a bit ridiculous. is ready to harvest quite yet. But everything over here is replenishing itself. So.
Okay, the soil is not dried out. What's going on? Thanks for trying to kill us a couple. <laughs> I was the oldest fat fairy. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I think I had Sayaka as the leader of the fat fairies. All right, here we go. Ready to harvest. Oh, what I get? Harvesting Wiz. Okay. You can make new clothes at the PT. Oh! Oh. Hey, DJ Money! Welcome to the stream. How you doing today? Alright, I'm gonna harvest these. And uh, replant, uh, I'm gonna replant flower seeds over here. Or... Alright, alright, let me uh, head back to the cafe. Visit the hundred acre wooden harvest your plants, then you can plant the new seeds and water. Ah! Harvest plants when you're ready to use them. recipes at the cafe with food, drink, salt, you stop wearing coins, so be sure to keep the cafe well stocked. Yeah. Okay. I. Oh, man. If you're stuck using the nose, we'll have to Alright, alright, alright. You, Ronko, and Fudge with the Fab Fairies. Ah, cool. Yes, I know I'm sold out. All right, what, what, what new cafe request do we have? Create a new dish. Manager here, making new dishes will keep customers coming back for more. We should make a new snack, dessert, or drink for the cafe. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, hold up here. All right, let's... Let's see if we can boost our... Uh, okay, we got some more... All right, we got some more theme points for that. All right, we, all right, so we did that one. Owner level increased, level four. All right, number of portions that we make for each dish has increased by five. Oh, okay, I see what's going on. And we got another new request, fairy tale feeling. A sort of Cinderella theme party. All right, let's, um, let's boost our, uh, Okay, all right, how many feet? All right, let's do a party. How many theme points do we have? We have seven. You just defeated Metopia, pretty much. All right, so the question is, so, what, so what's not themed right now? What, what isn't themed correctly right now? Oh!
place up to 21 more balloons. Okay. Okay, so how many theme points do we have now? Cafe background music. How many? We still only have seven theme points, though. That's the thing, we still only have seven theme points. Oh, that's why we only have seven theme points. So that's why we only have seven theme points. Question is, though, how do... Oh, I know. I've got to make... i got to make them in... in Chip and Dale's place, don't I? I gotta make the stuff in Chip and Dale's place, don't I? <laughs> you can't wait for Splatoon 3? None of us can wait for Splatoon 3, Fudge! <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna have to make more Mickey-themed stuff. Oh, what, what, what? No, no, I did not mean to leave! <laughs> okay, new recipes, right? I got something to tell you. Hey. Noble Wallenfloor. New recipes available. 30. Okay, here we go. Alright, I still don't have... I still have recipes for it. You're excited you might actually be able to play it. <laughs> oh god. All right, I see what's going on. I don't have I don't have enough to make all the rest of the stuff yet. All right. All right. It's going to be a while before I can Advance my cafe. I see how it is. All right, let's grab these. Goodness. All right. <laughs> 
Midnight Explorer out the new recipe. Oh, wow. Hold on. Hold on. What do we got here? Oh, we got fro- Oh, God. That's a frozen outfit? Elsa Resort outfit. That's a frozen outfit? Oh, there's Midnight Explorer outfit. All right. A new... Oh, wait, we got new Mickey outfits. What? Oh, the wetsuit. We got new Donald theme outfits. Oh, God, it's, it's wetsuits. Let's see what we got here. A lot of wetsuits. Wetsuits and resort outfits, I've noticed. Pinocchio outfit? Oh. Oh my god. This will Goodness! <laughs> Accessor- Oh, new accessories, too. Oh god, there's purple Mickey ears now. Mini ribbon ears. Oh my god, it's it, it, it's woomy shades. It's basically woomy shades. Look. <laughs> All right, there's something to think about for later. Frozen is your favorite Disney princess movie. So is mine, actually. I'm actually the same way on that, believe it or not. Oh, what's over here? Oh, wait a minute. I, I already did that. <laughs> Alright, I, I think I've had it with the, uh... I think I've had it with the, uh, With the caramel apple. I'd rather carry... I, I'd rather do something else instead. Oh... Special? Yeah, I, I've had it with the caramel apple. <laughs> Clothing type. Let me see, what's on other? Nah. Alright. All right, all right. So actually, um, let's go back to Lilo. Oh, oh, sold out. It says okay. Let's go back to Lilo and Stitch. Oh, what the hell? Oh no! Speaking of Frozen, <laughs> looks like we're gonna go to Frozen. I don't know. Okay, looks like we're going to Frozen next. Oh, this feels so good. Isn't it fantastic here? Oh, it's just the best. And won't Anna and Elsa be surprised when I tell them? Huh? Oh, hi. Are you from around here? It sure is a nice place to be. Just look at this nature. And this beach. This beach is an extra nice place to be. What with this beautiful blue ocean and the green mountains on the other side. Oh, it's just so amazing. I'm Olaf. And I like warm hugs. Okay. 
<laughs> and you are? Oh, DJ, huh? Ah, it's very nice to meet you. I've always wanted to know what it would be like to lay out in the sunshine. And so I came here by boat looking for a beach. That's right, all the way from Arendelle. But I was just thinking about pulling back. Uh, say, DJ, you want to go to Arendelle too? Oh, it's a wonderful place, even more wonderful than here. It's spring in Arendelle now, but come winter there'll be so much snow. What do you say? Come on. Uh, no, but why not? Oh, I know. You only have to get there. You just take that boat right over there. That's all. Uh, come on, let's sail that boat to Arendelle together. Oh, God. All right, let's go to Arendelle. All right. Right in the boat. That's the way. This is how we get to Arendelle. It would be nice to get back. I miss Anna and Elsa. Oh, uh, who are Anna and Elsa? Ah, uh, you have to meet them. Oh, really? We're off. All aboard for Arendelle. All right, so we're going to Frozen World. Let's do this. Well, Elsa is the queen, and Anna is basically a princess, so... <laughs> yeah, welcome to Arendelle! <laughs> okay, this is huge. Compared to the last two areas. It. This here is Arendelle. Welcome to Arendelle. Okay. Oh, uh -huh. now that's strange. Where could they be? I know. They're probably getting a big party together at the castle. Come on, DJ, to the castle. Okay. First, uh, first though, I got some. First though, I got some stuff to pop. Ah, uh, I wish I could control the camera better. I can't see when I'm... I'm not getting nice points? But I have, but I have the, the, I have a whole thing going here. Yeah, I know the way of the castle, but let me see if I can get... No, I, I'm not getting nice points. I also want to see if there's other stuff to, uh, to pop. Castle Gate Drag. Oh, it can't go that way. Alright. Used to watch every single day after school to babysit. Ah. Uh, no Anna? No Elsa? I wonder why. I don't. I bet they're playing hide and seek. They're grown-ass women! They're not playing hide-and-seek! What? Oh god, Dana's saying Gidget's disease. <laughs> Hello, Olaf. I see you return. If you're looking for Queen Elsa and Princess Anna, I'm afraid you won't find them. Yeah? Why? They've gone to the Valley of the Living Rock by the North Mountain. Yeah, why? Uh, some dangerous ghosts have appeared in Arendelle. Yeah, we're fr Come on, is it? Is this Disney's magical world or Ghostbusters? I mean, come on. <laughs> so they've gone to ask Grand Pappy for his advice. Yeah, why? Oh God! Oh. Olaf, I'm going to rename you Elmira if you don't stop asking that. I mean, what are you going to say next? Okay, I love you. Bye-bye. <laughs> uh, even Queen Elsa's magic won't work on these ghosts. 
but she said Grand Pappy was very knowledgeable about magic, and he might have some ideas about how to get rid of them. Oh, okay, so when are they coming back? Well, I expect they'll return when they're done speaking with Grand Pappy. So they'll be back soon? Well, that's right. Okay, I wonder how long soon I'm um, Olaf, you're dumb! You're even dumber in this than you are in Frozen! I mean, come on! <laughs> Alright, I can now use the episode board. Alright, let's, uh, let's take a look at the episode board. Why am I not getting nice points? Oh god, it's Hello Leta there. again. Hello, DJ. Oh, you oh. sure have traveled a long way. Oh, what a beautiful place this is. Then maybe I'll do some sightseeing. Oh. Oops, oh, this is no time for I've got a letter for you. I have something for you from Yensig. Here, I'll read it for you. DJ, I understand you'll be headed for the snowy mountains soon. I shall give you a wand more suited to the cold climate. I wish you luck in this faraway place. Here you go. And this wand was inside. Here you go. Ice crystal wand. Okay. Be careful out there, DJ. I'm afraid I have to fly off to my next delivery. Bye-bye now. Sightseeing will have to wait. See you later. I mean, later. Oh, God. Rocky Road. All right. Head off with recommended equipment. <coughs> Anna and Elsa went to the Valley of the Living Rock. I'm going to wait right here until they get back. Uh, they, they're meant to be back soon, but I wonder when soon is. Maybe like in one back. God! God! Oh, I... Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, why is basically Olaf's catchphrase. I know. I know, but it seems to he just seems to say it more in this game. Okay, I'll count down to the return. One, two, three, four. Sh God damn it, Olaf! 58? 50 now come on! Let me go on the damn quest already! <laughs> What was I just doing? <laughs> <coughs> oh yeah, waiting for Anna and Elsa. They went to the Valley of the... I know that! Let me go on the damn quest already! I know. I'll go there too. Oh, what do you think? How about you come with me? You're gonna be here too. <gasps> I know! I know! Yes! Let's get going! Get on with it! <laughs> get on with it! <laughs> okay. <sighs> this is the North Mountain. It has snow at the top, even in summer. See, over my head, no snow flurry, no problem. Now let's out for the Valley of the Living Rock. Where's the Valley of the... Exposition, exposition, talking out the ass again. <laughs> oh, it's a ghost. Hi there. Can you please tell me how to get to the Valley of the Living Rock? Wow, what a great way to say hello! My friends Anna and Elsa went to the Valley of the Living Rock to get advice on some silly ghosts. Oh, wait. You're new to town, aren't you? Uh, Olaf? That's a ghost. Olaf? That's a ghost! Go! 
God, you're dumb! <laughs> oh, come on, follow me, I'll show you around. You're... <laughs> Quest start. Alright. Wands from Arendelle can free ghosts some blocks of ice. Use the Y button to try it out. Hit frozen ghosts with your magic or by running into them to send them sliding. Okay. Ghosts take damage when hit by a frozen ghost. Take care of flaming hit as many as possible. If you run out of MP, use charged attacks. Hold the A button to collect three stars. Alright. Oh, we're going this way. Gotta be kidding me. There we go. Unfortunately, I am now out of MP. Well, you're something else. Oh, I'm talking out his ass. And he checks a shoe at him and it goes through him. Hold up, but would you look at that? That didn't impale. <laughs> Let's try to get rough to the valley of the living rock. There's nothing but snow as far as the eye can see. Oh, that makes me so happy. Come on, DJ. Ah. I'm just defeating him with the basic with the basic charge. I know. Oh, there's a chest. All right. I didn't get a chest. There wasn't a chest last time. Was there? Was there? Was there, a, was there a chest in the other area? Because I didn't... I don't remember seeing one. No, there wasn't. Oh, 
Oh, what did I just get? Oh, different music. I see. Oh, what the hell was that? Okay, it's boss time. All right. I did it? It's done? It's over? This game looks cute. What's it on? It's on the Switch! It was originally released for the 3DS, but, but this is a remastered version on the Switch. An event will begin past this point. Proceed further. Proceed further! Because I've gotten everything I need. Oh, here's the event. Anna! Elsa! Duh. Did you hear that? Olaf! <laughs> it worked out well, though. Yeah, it did. I'm here. I made it to the Valley of the Living Rock. Did you come all this way alone, Olaf? And did you run to any ghosts along the way? Yeah, but DJ took care of it. DJ? Who's that? I'll show you. Oh, DJ! Come on, me. Walk into frame. Huh. Where did she go? Where is this DJ anyway? <laughs> Did you forget to bring your brain again, Olaf? Yeah, I know. DJ disappeared. There I am. Oh, come on, DJ. Where'd you run off to? Olaf, didn't you say... Didn't you say this person took care of the ghost for you? Yep, I sure did. But doesn't that mean that... She'd have to be... Ooh, hey, wait, 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 wait. Introductions always come first. Of course, of course. Introductions all around them. Now let me introduce you to my friends Anna and Elsa. I'm Elsa, Queen of Arendelle. <laughs> he plays the president in pixels with pretty much the same intellectual level. Yeah, from what I heard, yeah. And I'm Anna of Arendelle. Sister. Welcome to Arendelle. But before that, we've got more important things to talk about. Is it true to feed the ghosts? Yes, it is. DJ's amazing. A few sweets at one and bam. Bye-bye, ghosts. Oh, I sense a strong magic force within. 
I am Grandpap. Might you be a magician? It's not a trick. It's magic. <laughs> no, or, or even better. No, a better line. I'm not a magician. I'm a mage. <laughs> Right, Perry, what a surprise! Elsa, Anna, you must listen carefully. I have to say, there's an old legend in Arendelle once every thousand years. Unpredictable snow spirits will appear on the North Mountain. Snow spirits? These spirits love nothing more than playing tricks on others, and their descent from the mountain is a danger for those living below. Could those be the ghosts that have shown up in Arendelle? I believe they must be. What else does the legend say? It goes on. When the snow spirits appear, so to the magician. That magician has the power to defeat the ghosts. So this must be the legendary magician then. That I do not know, but it seems this individual is well capable of defeating ghosts. Then they must be the one. But I can't tell just by looking at you. Either way, we're very glad you arrived when you did. Even if it was just a coincidence. Absolutely! We could really use your ghost defeating powers right now. Could I ask you a favor, DJ? As you've heard, Arendelle is having a serious ghost. So's everyone else, your majesty! So's everyone else! <laughs> if you really are the magician with the power to defeat ghosts, I'd be truly grateful if you could help us out. That's fantastic! Isn't that great news, Elsa? We found an ally! Thank you, DJ. Alright, let's try this again. Welcome to Arendelle! <laughs> On behalf of everyone here, I invite you to make yourself at home. Oh, where are you from? Now that we've met, we should get to know each other better. Uh, me? Uh, me too! Nothing like a new friend, right, Ola? Uh, yeah. Anna, Ola, let's head back to the castle. People start to worry about us. Sure thing, Elsa. Come back with us, DJ. You know, you asked me where I'm from, but you never gave me a chance to answer. A new episode is available. Kids gotta play. Warm hugs and hot cocoa. Oh jeez. All right. Well, let's uh let's collect stuff again. And we got that. Oh, that oh, that must be Anna. All right. Let me let me uh collect stuff again. So, question! Why are you keeping ice shards in boxes? <laughs> Alright, let's go to the next episode. So just chill to the next episode. <clears throat> Alright, kids gotta play. Kids of Arendelle are feeling blue, and it's all because of ghosts. Better see if you can help. All right, let's get the recommended equipment. <clears throat> let's start out. You know what Olaf told me? You can deal with the ghosts. Is that really true? Sure is. Amazing, right? One swing of that wand there, and DJ gets rid of the ghosts. Really? Well, that's even more amazing than I thought. What? Could you do us a favor, please? We have a secret hangout on North Mountain. But don't tell the grown-ups. It's just for us kids. Now there are ghosts on the North Mountain. And the grown-ups aren't letting us go there anymore. Uh, you know, the word is... Adult. Okay? Just saying. Alright? 
If only there was ghosts were hanging around. I thought maybe Queen Elsa would know what to do, but she's busy giving advice to Grump. Uh, the word is adult! <laughs> so please, DJ, deal with those ghosts and get them out of our hangout. Really? You'll do it? But aren't you afraid of ghosts? No. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Seriously! Is this Disney's magical world or friggin' Ghostbusters? Come on. <laughs> what? Oh, God. Yes, Olaf, stay here. Please, Olaf, stay here. <laughs> Please, for the love of the zapfish, stay here. <laughs> no, you won't be lonely. You can hang around with these two kids. All right, let's do this. Did not mean to do that. Okay. Okay, got that. All right, that's clear. Get the chest. Not a lot in the chest. All right. Onward to the next area. Oh god, challenge. Defeat all the ghosts in 60 seconds. Challenge complete! Woot! Alright, let me get everything else I need here. Alright. Oh, and those have stuff in them too? Hold up, hold up then. If the barrels have stuff in them, too. But yeah, if the barrels have stuff in them, too, well yeah, I'm gonna kill those barrels. Anything else in here? No? Alright. You're never... The I think you may have a... Ooh. Go get stuff. All right. Sweet. 
slay people. I have slay people. Pieces of slay. Why do I have pieces of slay? Okay. All right. I uh, now I gotta wait. Now I gotta remember. Wait to use that for the for the big boss. Okay. All right. Oh, what am I doing? Went the wrong way. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Did I miss something in the previous area? No. Because, all right, so, because what's with the, uh, what's with the exclamation mark? Did I miss something over here? That was a cha- Oh, no, that's what it was. It denoted a challenge. That's what it was. I know now. Okay. Alright, let me get everything from in here. Alright. Okay, we cleared that episode. Let's clear the next one. Ha. <clears throat> ah. The ghosts are gone. Yes, you can go back to your hideout. But, but I was all the way up in the north. I was all the way up at the north peak. You stayed down here. You did not watch me do that. Yeah, see? How do you know that? See? God damn it. People are dumb around here. <laughs> Well, that's how antidepressants are supposed to work, Kiyomi. The only problem is there are some people who have serotonin syndrome where a lot of antidepressants just simply don't work as well. Oh, they hid to watch me. Oh, jeez. Jeez! All right. 
so we got so let's go on to the next episode. Ah, uh, new sticker. Volunteer. Alright. A new episode is available for level 42! Oh, gee. Okay, but there is one more episode that I can do here, and that's Warm Hugs and Hot Cocoa. That's a level 28 quest. God, I, God I'm starting to sound like I'm playing Warcraft here. <laughs> well, that's a level 28 quest. Uh, <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Steve, Steve there. This is Drink I've always been to try. It's called Coco. Ever since Coco is the best thing around, if you're feeling down, a nice mug of hot cocoa will pick your mood right up in no time at all. Um... Yeah, 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 yeah. Coco, yeah. Try coffee, it's better. <laughs> well, can you imagine? I've never seen real cocoa. But maybe you could help. If you can find me the ingredients, then maybe we can make some! Alright, so what are the ingredients? You won't? Uh, my stomach will melt? That's a risk I'm willing to take in the name of Tasty Cocoa. How do you know it's tasty if you've never tried it? Come on. Well, no, melting is no fun. But I want to at least see what it looks like. What do you say? All right, all right. I knew you'd come through. I'd just be waiting here for you then, okay? Good luck. Oh, what's this hot cocoa stuff like? Well, busy. All right. Let me get the damn ingredients. Collect cocoa ingredients for Olaf. Wait. It's another quest? All right, let's get stuff. Coco Alright. More cocoa ingredients. Yeah, because the next one the next one has a challenge, I think. Oh, come on. There. All right, the next one has a challenge on it. Let's see what the challenge is. <laughs> challenge. Defeat lots of ghosts in 30 seconds. Challenge completed. So how many so how many did I defeat? Is there anything else to get over here? Alright, well if I completed the challenge, it just says defeat lots of ghosts in 30 seconds. It didn't say I had to defeat all of them. Whoops, did not mean to do that. Let's get back here.
Alrighty, we got that. Alright, time for the big boss fight. <coughs> big boss fight! Alright. Got that. Right, let's make sure to get everything. <coughs> oh, there's fish here? Okay, this fish here. Come on. All right. <clears throat> Come on, you can get close to this. <clears throat> Got a sticker. Fishing fun. Oh, gee. Alright. That's enough fishing. That's enough fishing. Alright. Alright, we got all the cocoa ingredients. Good. <clears throat> there. And that means we can whip up a batch! Okay, what's the great? Since we have to play to make some hot cocoa for Anna and Elsa! Won't they be surprised? Okay. Okay, so that's a new recipe. Because I don't think... Yeah, yeah, the next level there is level 42, so... Okay. Yeah, apparently there's nothing else here I can do. 
So... So at this... So I think at this point it's time to head back. Well, after getting more vista. Yes. Yes, we're heading back home. Because I am not leveled up enough to do to do another uh, to do another quest. <laughs> Salutation! How's it going, DJ? <laughs> it looks like you you're plenty used to life. Keep here. up the good work. It's like you've only grown more dependable than you were the first time we met. Do you remember that moment? The first time I came out to meet you? You were so surprised that your eyes nearly bugged out of your head. <laughs> now don't try and deny it. I was there too, you know. Oh, but this is no time for idle chit-chat. Miss Terry has been asking for you, DJ. <coughs> Miss Terry. <coughs> oh, God. Knowing her, she's sure to have something both mysterious <laughs> and very exciting to talk about with you. And as a very special service to you today, DJ, I'll send you to Miss Terry's place first class. In other words, you're just going to pop me over here. Sorry to be so sudden. I have called you here to discuss the dream puzzles, your gateway to the dream world. There are dreams here, too? <laughs> you know about the puzzle pieces? Do you know about twinkle stones? No, I don't know about twinkle stones. But you're going to tell me about them, I have a feeling. These gems can create puzzle pieces. The pieces you make will be beautiful indeed. I shall give you some red twinkle stones. Why not try using them to make a puzzle piece? Hmm? Okay. At the shop of one, you can exchange twinkle stones for randomly selected puzzle pieces. Choose which twinkle stones are hi or hi-ho stones to exchange. We'll see which dream puzzles you might get a piece from. Choose it. Alright, alright, let's see. Okay. Twinkle stones. Yes. The party time puzzle piece. Ooh, all right, that's getting close. All right. You made the most wonderful puzzle piece. Keep making and collecting these to form a picture. When the picture is complete, you witness something even more amazing. Gather a lot of twinkle stones and bring them to me. You may find them in the caverns guarded by the forest dwarves. It's Snow White Land, isn't it? It's... I... You don't even have to tell me. It's... It's freaking Snow White Land, isn't it? <laughs> Once you leave this place, a melody will guide you there. Good luck, DJ. The melt. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah. Ho, hi, ho, hi, ho, hi, ho. Yeah, it's Snow White Land. All right, let me pick these. All right, let's go to frickin' Snow White Land. <clears throat> huh. Four-piece puzzle amateurs takes my stack of thousand-piece puzzles. Over. Oh, here we go. The seven dwarves.
Oh, God. And I'm, I, I'm just following them into the house. <laughs> I'm just following them into the house. That's okay. Boy, I sure am hungry. After another hard day's work in the mine. My stomach's growling loud enough to wake sleepy. Will someone just make dinner already? Not me. I'm so hungry I can't even see straight. In fact, I'm seeing eight of us right now. But that's impossible. There are only seven of us. You've got to be in a pretty bad place if you're seeing eight. Uh, hello? Hello, hi. I just, I just followed you in. Because, because apparently, apparently that's not ten times of creepy around here. Uh, <laughs> but I really am honest. Here, I'll show you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wait, eight? Someone's in here with us. An outsider. Yikes! Run! Oh, who are you? To have you here as a, as a guest in our home. Uh, no, wait. We didn't invite you. Anyone just barges into someone else's home is going to be up to no good. Game, why are you doing this to me? Why, why didn't I just like, why didn't I just like ask them while they were outside the house? You know, this is creepy! That, that, that's not true. Why, Snow White just showed up one day and she, she, ah, she turned out to be a very nice girl and a princess. Hmm. You got a point. Why don't we hear what our guest has to say? What's your name and what brings you here? Uh, DJ, is it? Is that food I smell? So you're a cafe owner? Yes, very impressive indeed. By the way, what's a cafe? You're all grown ass men! You don't know what a cafe is? <laughs> Yeah, you know, Dana's like, couldn't they have given you a starship? <laughs> and then again, it begs the question. <laughs> oh, stop. Hun, what does magic need with a starship? <laughs> to paraphrase Captain Kirk. in the black hole. Star Wars Christmas special. Oh, God. A place that serves food and drink. As okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. Even if you've never heard the word cafe. What's up? Who the fuck? You've never heard of a restaurant? <laughs> oh my god. No, these dwarves are not smart at all. I mean, come on. <laughs> Kill me, it's video game logic. <laughs> but what would a cafe owner be doing in a place like this? didn't bring us any food, by any chance. You're looking for twinkle stones? Twinkle stones. Twinkle stones! Just say gems! Can you, could you just say gems? <laughs> could you just say gems? I mean, seriously. <laughs> oh, God. We make our living mining jewels, you see. So, if it's jewels you're after, we're the ones to ask. 
Yeah, yes, jewels. I, I did not make up the... I, I'm sorry, Doc, I did not make up the term twinkle stones. It, it, it's just what... See, see, there's this fortune teller back in Castleton, and uh, she's apparently not too bright. <laughs> Name's Doc. Pleased to meet you. Even Patrick knows he's both stupid and he lives under a rock. Yeah, I know. Cut down! Don't be introducing yourself! Why not? This is our guest. <laughs> it's like, why not? This is our guest. Yeah, the guest had just followed you in, because I don't know why. <laughs> wow, Dobie, your stomach sure is noisy! It only makes sense. We're all so hungry after all. That's right, Dopey doesn't talk, does he? As it happens, Jay, we're awfully busy at the moment. We've got to hush up our growling tummy. Would you mind coming back later? Go on, gal! Take a hit! Well, I really am especially hungry. If only Snow White were here. And, oh, episode board. <laughs> All right. First, I want to pick stuff. Oh, what about there's something here too? Can I actually go in the mine? No, I can't. There's a sign there. Oh, oh, okay. Spicy spice fruit. Okay. Whatever. Oh, birds. Those are Snow White's birds. I get it. Alright. Episode board. Little guys, big stomachs. There's a whole house of dwarves and you need a whole lot of food. Pronto, maybe you can help. Okay. Okay, starting the episode. <clears throat> I'm so hungry. <sighs> what are you doing? Hurry up and get dinner ready. The princess is on her way. We've got to make dinner and fast. Uh, happy, you do. Bashful, you do it! Um, Sneezy, you do it. Uh, grumpy, you do it. Sleepy, you do it! Uh, dopey, you do it. Why is everyone looking at... Alright, why is everyone looking at me? Yeah. What's this? You've come back? I was here the whole time! God damn it. <laughs> God, these dwarves are stupid! Dana's like everybody in this game is stupid. Oh, jeez. You'll do the cooking for us, DJ? Well, isn't that lucky? Thanks so much. That's cafe owner for you, eh? Uh, <laughs> we, we don't really have much in the way of ingredients. Oh, God. Then we're going to have a hard time cooking anything at all. No one wants to go looking for ingredients when this hungry. Oh, you'll bring us the ingredients, too? My goodness, that's quite a lot of trouble you're going to. We are planning on having stew tonight. Why don't just have... We just don't have anything to make it with. Well, I just went around picking a bunch of stuff. I... You've got covered, have you? Well, thank goodness for that. <laughs> Th thanks a lot, DJ. Try and make it back while I'm still awake. <sighs> okay. Yeah, Dopey doesn't talk. Yeah, I just know you've got something up your sleeve. Yeah, it's called food. Be, be, 
careful out there. <laughs> All right. Oh, DJ, you're back. He didn't give me a chance to leave. Did you find those ingredients? This is it. Okay, everything we need to make stew. Oh, because I already had the ingredients when I, after I went around and picked everything. I already had the, ingre me, the ingredients, so it just went to the next stage. And by we, I mean, I mean you. Would you please? Gosh, I wonder what kind of st stew you're gonna make. I'm curious myself! I wouldn't touch that stew with a ten foot pole! Uh, don't, don't be that way, Grumpy. I'm, I'm sure it'll be delicious. Okay. Here, I, I call this New England clam chowder. <laughs> smells wonderful. Oh, it looks delicious. Oh, it woke me right up. Ah. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to dig in. Ha! <laughs> can't trick me with a bowl of stew! You're a great cook, DJ. You wanna know something funny, though? All these dwarves are named kinda after their personality. And... And... And I think the dwarves... Did the dwarves have these names in the original story, or is that... Or is this all Disney? You never read the original story. Well, either way, even if you even if you only go back to 1938, that's still that's still that's still a, a, almost 40 years before the Smurfs. The Smurfs ripped off Disney. The 50s. Well, either way, the Smurfs ripped off Disney. <laughs> Yeah, ri yeah, Disney ripped off the Zuka. Yeah, I th yeah, because I think this. Well, because I th I thought the Smurfs went back to 1976. Let me double check here. Let's see how far. Let's see how far back the Smurfs date to. I mean, either way, it's still later. Either way, it's still later than 1938. Ah. Uh. Oh, Smurfs are Belgian. No, you're right. 1958. You're right. 1958 are when the Smurfs first became a thing. Uh, that's still 20 years after Disney Snow White. <laughs> so yeah, that. Well, anyway, that's still 20 years after Disney Snow White. So Peo ripped off Disney. Proof. You're a great cook, DJ. Thank you so much. My name's Happy. Yeah, I couldn't have guessed. I'm sleepy. <sighs> and I'm sleepy. <laughs> Cut out! We can't be trusting this stranger yet! Oh, come on! Would you just look at this delectable meal? Snow White came out in 38. I do know that much. <laughs> no good! Still don't trust her! Say, um, can, can, can we uh, eat now? Not yet! We have to wait till the princess gets here! Oh no, the princess! What's wrong, dog? The princess is coming and this place is a mess! Ah, you're all looking to me! <laughs> well, to be fair, these guys do work in the mine all day. The last thing they want to do is come home and do more work. <laughs> I do have to admit. <laughs> it sure is! She'll be so disappointed. <sighs> she accomplished this journey. I'm so embarrassed that we haven't been cleaning up. 
Well, that won't solve anything. We've got to do something. Thanks for the stew, DJ. We really want a big stew for the princess today. We love to eat it with you right this very minute. But first, we've got to tidy this place up so it's fit for royalty. Time to set aside our, glo our growling stomachs and get to work. I really am sorry. See you later, DJ. Dustiest of poop. Oh, oh. Alright. Take a look at the episode board. Dustiest of them all. Alright. So I got so I'm gonna help clean the house too. Okay. Now look here, man. We got to clean this place up before the princess comes. Happy, you do it. Bashful, you do it! Um, Sneezy, you do it. Grumpy, you do it. Ah, sleepy, you do it! Uh, dopey, you do it. Uh. And Dopey's looking at me. And now everyone's looking at me. Looking at Doc. And they're looking at me. DJ? <laughs> You're always showing up at the unlikeliest of times. You clean the cottage for us, DJ? Wow, that's fantastic news! You'd really be doing us a favor! You're such a good cook. I bet you clean as well as the princess, too. Wait. Okay, d d d all right, um, all right, uh, let me get this straight. Snow White, a princess, royalty, does the cleaning for you around here. God, you guys are incorrigible! Why don't we wait outside for a while then, so we don't get in the way? You want this intruder to ruin all our furniture? The DJ won't do that for me. Remember that delicious stew? Our furniture will be fine. So, um, uh, thanks in advance, DJ. Alright, so what do I have to do? Clean up by collecting all the dust from... I'm collecting dust. Okay. Oh, there's Stuff. Oh, there's dust in here, too. <clears throat> Just look at how clean this place is. I can't believe it. There's no speck of dust to be found. To have gone off to all this trouble just for us? You're a real giving type, aren't you, DJ? Um, uh, this is kind of embarrassing, but, um... We'll introduce ourselves to... Say what? Leave me out of this! I'm... bashful. I can't believe I'm saying this. And that angry one over there, that's grumpy. Dopey over there is a quiet one. Oh god. Just because someone's good at cleaning a cottage doesn't mean you should trust them at the drop of a hat. <laughs> Don't mind him, DJ. Grumpy's always like that. <laughs> hey, fellas, the princess will be here soon.
Oh, it, it's Snow White and Prince Charming. They came together. Hello. Hello, everyone. How have you been? Thank you for having us. Oh, everything's so clean. And smells good, too. What? Is that stew I smell? You're cleaning and cooking. That's wonderful. I feel so relieved. Well, uh, as it happens. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm Snow White. And who might you be? Uh, Princess, let me introduce you. Uh, DJ just happened by one day, and uh, DJ's the one who did the cooking and the cleaning. And... Oh, is that so? Thank you, DJ. Uh, I'm the Prince of this kingdom. Uh, pleasure to meet you. And Prince Charming. <laughs> well, uh, since introductions are over and all, isn't it about time we... Uh, what are you trying to say, Bashful? Spit it out! <laughs> well, don't be your stomach sure is noisy! Please, right, Doc, we're all just about starving! So you haven't eaten yet? Dear me! Then why don't we all sit down together to enjoy the delicious dish that DJ made? That sure was tasty, DJ! It's been a long time since we've had a feast like that. Huh, <laughs> anything tastes good when you're hungry enough. It really was delicious, DJ. Thank you. You're an excellent cook. May I ask what brings you here, DJ? You must have come from a very far away land. Yeah, it's called Minnesota. <laughs> So you're searching for twinkle stones. I see. Uh, now let me think. I'm sure we dug those up in our mine from time to time. Well, we let you into our mine. That way you can try digging for your twinkle stones yourself. What? You can't be serious! The mine's a very important place for us. No way am I gonna let this intruder into our mine. Well, I I see your point. Uh, it's not the question, but... Uh, oh, give us some time to think it over, okay? Oh, come on, not you two. <laughs> Fine. I'll teach you how to mine for jewels. Oh, Doc, you're so kind. Say, DJ, I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. Best of luck! All right. All right, we got that one now. And we got another episode. Okay. So let's get this episode done here. <coughs> off to work. Hi ho, hi ho. It's off to work we go. All right, DJ. This here is the mine. There are caverns inside, see? And next we can dig up ores and jewels. And we'll go to my cavern first. Come on. Swing your pickaxe in the same rhythm as your... Oh, God, it's a rhythm game. The dwarf goes first, then it's your turn. Press the A button in the same rhythm as the dwarf. If you don't miss any beats, you'll level up. Keep hitting the rock and you'll get more twinkle stones after 10 rounds of game ends. Oh, okay. All right, let's try this. Ready? Here we go. All right. Oh, all right. Here we go. All right. We're still getting twinkle stones. Okay. This is where input lag fails me here.
All right. All right, here we go. All right. Oh, I missed one. Mining complete. Yeah, this is where the input lag fails me. That there is a twinkle stone. Okay. Wow, well done, DJ. You found twinkle stones in the very first dig. <laughs> Just dumb luck. And it was a uh, book. It does look an awful lot like that book Doc used to have. It is. That's my true book. I thought it was gone for good. You found my book, DJ. Thanks. I'm so glad to have it back. May I see it? According to this, DJ, there's something even better than the twinkle stone. A sparkle stone. And I quote, Whoever finds a sparkle stone without the happiness of his or her dreams. Wow, can you imagine? I sure wish I could see one of the sparkle stones. I bet they're real pretty. To the professional jewel known as a sparkle stone. Many have spoken of it, but few have seen it. I wonder if it might be. No, it can't be. In any case, DJ, you're now free to dig in this cavern whenever you like. Hey, don't be any caverns over to outsiders! This is my cabin, Willie, and I say it's okay. Ah, have it your way. Alright, DJ, good luck! Every time you mine for twinkle stones, you use up a pickaxe. You recover one pickaxe every 30 minutes, maximum three pickaxes. You can find out how many pickaxes you have left in the new splash section of the notice board. That way you can keep track of them no matter where you are. You can now use the mining board to take part in mining sessions and complete more episodes to access different caverns. Okay. <clears throat> oh, we got high ho stones too. Alright. Alright. And another sticker! Can you dig it? And the next episode is not available until level 35. Ah. All right. Well, let's uh Let's grab stuff then. I'm just going to grab some more stuff. Got another sticker. All right, we're at level 34 now. All right, so we've pretty much done all we can do here. That's the thing, we've pretty much done all we can do there. So... So I guess at this point, what we can do... Oh, what's going on here? Is there a new episode? No, there isn't a new episode. <clears throat> but, oh, what I can do is I can go here and spend stones. All right.
No, 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 not, no, not that. Okay, mystery items? Let's see what we got here. Uh, unfortunately, there's no Mickey furniture here. I think I end up getting it all. All right. <clears throat> 30 high-ho stones for one puzzle piece. Okay. I don't have the puzzle frame. Oh no! Alright, let's see what we got. I don't have the frame. Oh jeez. But, but, so your levels are how many stickers you have. Yes! Yeah, that's basically the level. Choose puzzles. Okay. Not enough. Alright. Well, there's nothing new. So why is it still saying new? Okay. Oh! <clears throat> Guess what? Now I'm level 35. And I can make new stuff! Okay. No, no, I don't want to change my destiny. Alright, I can make... Alright, alright. Alright, hopefully, let me, let me, alright, let me grab some, let me grab the new stuff that I can make. Friendship medal? Oh, what's this? Ah, well, well, let me tell you something. I, I can, I, I have found it. <coughs> All right. Okay, <clears throat> so what I'm going to do next... Is I'm going to unlock the stuff in here. Because I can get new stuff now. All right, let's see what's over here Tell now. Tell me. High class outfit. New recipes available, 17. Oh, wow. All right, let's see what we got now. Arctic quest outfit? Hmm. High class outfit. Dapper Anna outfit, Dapper Elsa outfit. No, A Alice Summer. There's Alice in Wonderland stuff here too. <clears throat> and what about for new accessories? What do I have? Hawaiian mini ears, no. 
ship ears, Dale ears. Uh, now, if you had cat ears, I'd, I'd think about it. Guess what? All right, now let me uh, go to the furniture. Po uh, actually, now let me go to the furniture place. Available 14. Let's see what we got. No, still no new Mickey stuff. Well, I got. I still have a whole bunch of new stuff here. That must be the Cinderella stuff. God, a lot of stuff got unlocked. Hey there! All right. Actually, it's, I will say this, it is starting to get a little late. Oh, what the? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Minnie's hair salon? Wait, I can open this up now? <clears throat> okay. Welcome. Hi, DJ. Thank you for visiting Welcome Minnie's to salon. My salon. I'm so glad you're here. I want to get even deeper into fashion and style. <laughs> That's why I decided to open this place. I can give you a new hairstyle, change your hair color, <laughs> even try out some makeup looks. Isn't that wonderful? If you'd like to give it a try, just now say the word. Find let's style find the style that suits, that suits, you. suits you. Ooh, wow. Oh, God. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna try this. All right, if we're full match up, I'm sure you get some nice comments. All right, let's what take a look. What shall we do today? All right, what colors are available? <gasps> oh! Do they have anything that's even more? Because that's what I have right now, but damn it. I want to go even more purple. See, that's more pink, though. Ooh, how do I want that purple? That purple. Hmm. That's kind of a hot pink. That's really pink, though. Um, hmm. I'm going to go for this. And let me see if there are any new hairstyles. Oh. Hmm. There are new hairstyles.
Oh my god. I could give myself the Junko. <laughs> Junko fucking Hiroshima! <laughs> hey, the Janeway. <laughs> the Sailor Moon! Oh god. Okay. That's more like the real life me. All right, I'm going to go with this. There, that's more like the real life me. Well, except for the purple hair, but my hair will be purple again at some point. All right, Goodbye. Let's keep that where Please it is. Come again. Do you think? Is there anything else here? Nope, apparently not. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, that's 36. Ah! Damn it, it's 36. Okay, so I wasn't the only one who thought Junko in, while seeing that hair. No, you weren't. <laughs> you were very much not the only one. And that doesn't open until 42. Anything new in here, or is it the same stuff? Oh, it's the same stuff. All right. Oh, that's a place for fishing. Okay. Yeah, but I, I, I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna call it a stream pretty shortly here. Because it is getting to be that time. But we made quite a lot of progress, actually. We made a lot more progress than I thought we were going to make today. You're starting to get into Danganronpa again? Sweet. Alright, let me re... Let me, uh... Let me do... Let me restock this here. Because we're sold out again. All right. New cafe requests. Oh. Sugar rush party. Five or more kinds of sweets. All right. Let's do, uh, Pooh Bear treats this time. Oh, we got request cleared. Okay, request fulfilled. Raise a new dish. Okay. All right, so... Oh, we only have four theme points. Oh, because I'm not making mickey theme food right now. Oh. 
And I got I gotta get the I gotta get that. Yeah, I need the Mickey themed table is what I need. Okay, so that's going to be it for uh, tonight, folks. Uh, whoops. So that's going to be it for tonight. Uh, thank you, everyone, for joining us tonight. It has been fun. And I got, and I got to yell at some dumb, dumb characters. <laughs> I mean... I mean, seriously. Olaf... Olaf has got to be the dumbest character in this game. Okay? Seriously. Seriously, why, Olaf? Why? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Tomorrow at 11 p.m. Eastern, um, it's time for our, our, our after league, not quite league, league night. Candle pin bowling. <laughs> Or, or I would say, or, or you could say, our not quite league after league league night. There we go. I think that's what I think that's why, I think that's how I worded it. I can't remember exactly how I worded it, but, but it's it, it's our bowling night Friday night. So uh, we're gonna so we're gonna be doing that. I hope uh, I hope you all can join me tomorrow night because it is going to be fun. Let's uh, hand out our. Shoutouts for tonight. We had two raids tonight. We had a raid from Hero Chris and a raid from Kiyome. Let's um Ah, Hero Chris and Kiyome were both playing Metopia. And uh and Kiyome just defeated the Darkest Lord. So they're gonna be doing uh so from here on out, uh, they're going to be doing um, they're going to be doing end game content. <laughs> I will stay safe, Kiyome. We also had a couple hosts from uh, Epic Xander and Matt the Octoling. Let's uh, shout them both out as well. Not Matt, Matt. Ah, <laughs> uh, and Xander was last playing Left 4 Dead 2. Matt was last playing Roblox, so give them all your love, folks, because they they deserve it. And um, and we're uh, once again going to raid Fuwa because um, because she's still doing her epic subathon. At this point, uh, at this point, she might go longer than Melon Cat. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Um, so let's. Uh, so let's raid Fuwa. And, uh, well, hold on. There we go. And until tomorrow, you know what to do, folks. Follow and subscribe. Join the Particle Acceleration. You can also join us in Discord. That is exclamation mark Discord in the chat. Or just scroll down to where it says join the Particle Acceleration on Discord. Till tomorrow at 11 p.m. Eastern, I am DJ Particle, and I'm out of here. Peace! <laughs>